and hello viewers in today's video you will learning how to add multiple table of contents in a microsoft word document and from that i mean that i have already created a table of content in this document that you can see right here and i can go to any page i want just by pressing the left click and clicking this so this in this way you can see that i have come to uh, the part of document where i want to go uh, but now sometimes uh, you are required to prepare uh, a document in which you have two table of contents for example if i want to add a t uh, two table of contents in this video uh, in this document what i will do is uh, i will have to uh, make bookmarks for example if i want to separate this an extra from this table of content this an extra part and I want to add a table of content separately for these and extras. What I will do is I will just come to the document and see that see locate the point where I need to add another table of content. So I just press control and click and I come to the next spot and I, right above it I want to add a table of content. So I'll just add a page break here and in this place uh i will add the table of contents so firstly we need to make bookmarks for these two table of contents so for example from this point above right up to the table of contents part right here i'll come to from home i'll go to the insert part and in this insert tab i will come to the bookmarks tab and just press write anything like main and add similarly I will go back to that selection point and from the next sure a point till the bottom of this document I'll keep on selecting till it reaches the bottom of this document So now that I have selected that, I will come to the bookmark point again and just call it an extras and I will add that. So now I have added two table of contents. So I will just create this table of contents again for you just to see what I have done. So now that I have removed this table of contents, I will come back to create it again. This can be done by going to the tabs, reference tab and table of contents and just automatic table of contents. So I have a table of content but the problem now is that the annexures are showing here while I want these not to show here but to show at the point separately where the annexures are located. So what you can do is just click anywhere on this table of content and press alt plus f9 this will give you field codes uh, and then you can come right here at the end and just press this slash and then b space now what was the name of the bookmark that we used first i think it was main yes so you can just press alt plus f9 again and you see that it has not changed but now what you have to do is just press right click and update and update the entire table so you can see that table of content has gone up to the fourth point and though no annexures are shown here now to add table of contents to the step to the next spot all you have to do is copy this table of content back control C and then come to the next spot where you made a space for the next right here you can come in here and just press ctrl v now the table of content is added here you have to just go back you can select it here too and just press right click and toggle field codes and remove this main 
and just write an extras and alt plus f9 or toggle field codes again okay i don't know what that is so i'll have to just i guess go back yes control the no okay so i'll have to just select this all again and toggle field codes then click here and alt f9 again and right click update field okay so bookmarks name not given i have to check it again what was the name of the bookmark it was nx jers yes i'll copy it again so i have no problems now okay so alt f9 b and space and next shares then alt f9 again right click update and as you can see that the table of contents have been added for the next shares separately in the document so in, in this document now i have two table of contents as you can see one table of content is right here and other table of content is right here so that's it guys that's the video so thank you and please subscribe to this channel for more tutorials and other videos thank you